You want to be on camera? Sure, let's do it. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, you don't. No. <laughs> What's up, gentlemen? So, as I've said before, proper diet planning prevents poor diet performance. And so today, what I thought I'd do is actually show you what I eat in a day, all right? Um, but I'm also going to show you sort of like how it starts because today is Sunday, and every Sunday my wife and I sort of prep the food for. What do you? What do you? What do you? You prep. I. Wait, you prep. I prep. You do. I'm prepping. Okay. I'm prepping. Today I'm prepping. I'm gonna bring you along. I'm also gonna show you what my day looks like in terms of my diet. But it all starts with Sunday prepping all the meat. So my diet is pretty boring. Um, I eat the same thing pretty much every day with the exception of my HelloFresh that we do like once a week where we'll actually make like three meals. HelloFresh is today's video sponsor. I'll tell you a little bit more about them later. But the bottom line is every Sunday I prep the meat that I'm gonna be eating for the entire week. So let me show you the meat that I'm gonna be grilling this week. I'm gonna be having chicken legs, also about three pounds of salmon fillets, and then a pound of ground bison. Um, I like a variety. These all are prepped, they are ready to go on the grill. I'm also making a huge pot of pearled barley. I like to make like a grain every week, whether or not it's quinoa, wheat berries, or barley. Barley, let me grab that, looks like this, right? You get it in the store pretty much like where all the, like, the rice and things like that are. Now the reason why I love barley is because it's super like low glycemic index and it tastes like pretty much anything you season it with. I kind of use it like rice, but in my opinion, this has like more substance to it. It also is like crazy high in fiber. You boil it, you strain it, it's ready to rock. So when the barley's finished, this is what it looks like. So the meat and the barley will act as my foundation for most of my meals for the week. But like I said, three nights a week we will actually do HelloFresh. What do you want to have tonight? Pick it out. I'm, co I'm cooking because the deal is all of these meals are like super quick. They're easy. They're fresh. They save you time. And honestly, I can do it. And I and and which one? Let's go meatless. Let's do Mediterranean baked veggies with couscous. Ooh. So tonight we're doing the Mediterranean baked veggies, and it comes with with this bag. And the thing that you're gonna love so much about HelloFresh is that all the ingredients are like super fresh and the other beautiful thing and reason why I love it is that you can like knock out a meal in typically like 30 minutes but they also have some options that take like less time all right so check it out for this one I got my scallions I also have little cherry tomatoes asparagus the couscous got the thyme the feta cheese the sliced almonds and the flavor packets the reason why you're gonna love HelloFresh as much as I do is that it's super freaking convenient it literally gets delivered directly to your door the box arrives it's on ice you unpack it and then you've got your meals they're ready for the week the other reason why I love HelloFresh so much is that it saves me a ton of time. I don't need to go to the grocery store and spend like 50 minutes going up all the different aisles to find the specific ingredients for the recipe I'm cooking. HelloFresh offers so many recipes to choose from each week to help you break out of your recipe rut. So literally, like every single recipe that I have had from HelloFresh has been absolutely delicious. The other thing that I've noticed is that the ingredients seem fresher than the grocery stores and I think it's really because of the whole like system that HelloFresh has and how quickly they get it delivered directly to your door. HelloFresh is also like super flexible so you can go in and change like your delivery days and if you need to skip a week no problem. So you're saving time, you're also saving money. And the thing that I love is that I don't waste a lot of stuff because if you were just to be like, yo, I wanna go to the grocery store and make this meal, you would have to buy like a big thing of couscous. You would have to buy like a whole bushel or whatever they call a big pack of scallions. But with HelloFresh, they send you exactly the amount of ingredient that you need in order to make that specific meal. Oh my God, come here, try this. Oh, that's good. <laughs> it's so good. That's so good. Oh my god. Now, like, it's, it is, like, this is incredible. The feta and the almond? I know. It's, uh, it's just, it's, it's incredible. Literally, it took me 30 minutes. Gentlemen! Hit the link down below, hellofresh.com. Make sure to use the code ALPHAM10 to get 10 
free meals, including free shipping. HelloFresh.com, Alpha M10, to get 10 free delicious meals plus free shipping. This is incredible. But now what I'm actually going to do is tell you and show you exactly what I'm eating breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Gentlemen, good morning. It is officially Monday and the time is 8.45. I've been working now for about two hours. The only thing that I've consumed since 8 p.m. last night is a cup of black coffee, actually two cups of black coffee. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go out for a little run. First thing in the morning after I work, I like to get outside, do cardio, and just get some fresh air. I like to go for runs, walks, or even like hike a mountain. In my opinion, getting outside is a great way, the only way for me to start my day. After I'm finished, it's going to be around like 9, 45, 10 o'clock. I'm going to have my first meal. Gentlemen, I'm going to run. I'll see you in a minute. my run the time is 10 15 time to eat breakfast right, so in terms of what I eat for breakfast today I'm going with a protein shake typically I will get into like ruts where I will eat like egg whites and oatmeal with a scoop of protein for like a month and then I'm like I'm kind of sick of this and then I go protein shake currently I am on a protein shake kick I go with a third of a cup of ice I also use Almond milk. Almond milk is awesome because it's super like low calorie and honestly I think it's delicious. Protein powder. Today I'm going with peanut butter. One pack of sweetener. I have never counted my calories. I've always focused on the quality and the quantity of the food that I'm eating. And I also know that hey, if I look in the mirror and I look a little chubby or I hop on the scale and my weight's like going like this or it's going like that, I can pretty much adjust my calories according. It's literally impossible to wing a healthy diet. If you're going out to eat like two, three times a day or like a few times a week. Now for me, my wife, we will go out tip or actually we've been ordering in typically on Friday and Saturday. We'll do like one meal where we're ordering out whether or not it's pizza or sushi or Chinese or whatever. Uh, but it's a great way to sort of break the monotony of a diet, but also allow yourself a little freedom, a little flexibility in order to not be so super for strict. The other thing that's helped is the HelloFresh. Breaks the monotony, but still the quality of the food is there. And also like we know the ingredients, we see it. It's not like a bunch of processed crap and it's honestly super freaking delicious. Um, now what I'm going to do is actually get a shower, come back out before I leave for work. I'm going to make lunch. Talk about that. All right, gentlemen, feeling fresh. Now let's make lunch. I'm going to need one of these salmon barley and let's do some carrots and some cashews. Scoop out about two cups of barley and then I'm gonna have let's see one probably do another one I'm also gonna be adding a little seasoning all right I'm gonna be using Frank's Red Hot few little dashes of that and then I also will throw a little sriracha on as well. One of the reasons why I have upgraded my container game to glass is because it's a lot healthier, a lot better when you heat it up and put it in the microwave, all right? Containers like this Tupperware are great if it's cold, but you should not, from what I understand, heat these up. I will also take some salted cashews. Cashews are my favorite nut and so what I will do is get a little baggie and take, I don't know, probably about that much. What is that? Like half a cup of cashews. They're salted, they're delicious, um, some good fats and they're just a nice little snack and crunch after work. I will also take about three carrots. I love carrots and so typically each day I will bring a few carrots with me. Definitely wash these before you consume them. And so this essentially is what I'm going to be eating for my lunch. Now dinner. Let's talk about dinner. Dinner typically is going to be for me around 7.30 or 8 p.m. I will also be using about a cup, cup and a half of the barley, but instead of the salmon, I will cut the meat off of about four to possibly five legs, depending on the size. I'll cube them up and I will toss them in the barley. I will also throw half an avocado and season with my dynamic duo, the Frank's Red Hot and 
and the sriracha. Now for dessert, a little sugar-free Jello. All right, Jello is amazing because it tastes great. It also has like zero calories, and this is the perfect thing to satisfy my sweet tooth at the end of a day instead of like grabbing like a cake or a piece of candy. This stuff is amazing. Now during the day, if I'm hungry, if I want like a snack or I need something a little bit sweet, typically I will keep like protein bars around the office. I'll have half of one or I'll eat a full one depending on how hungry I am. But essentially, that is my daily diet. This is it. This is my diet. This is the reason why I am able to maintain a low body fat percentage, lean muscle mass at the age of 44. 44, exactly, 44. Clean living, clean eating, and T. Shanley. Gentlemen, if you dug this video, why don't you drop, drop me one of these to be like, yo, Alpha, that was fun. Let's do it again.